everyone. Welcome to the series of data analysis using Excel. This is Dr. Atman Shah. In this video, I'm going to discuss how to perform pad samples t-test in Excel and its interpretation. If you find this video useful, kindly like, share, comment, and subscribe. Let's begin with the idea of pad samples t-test. Pad samples t-test is used when we are interested to know the mean difference between two pad groups. So here I have the hypothetical uh, data of uh, 30 students and the result in test one and test two. So test one is conducted before remedial classes and test two is conducted after remedial classes. So we are collecting the data from the same student before and after remedial classes. And therefore this makes a pair and we can use paired samples t-test. Now what is the null and alternative hypothesis in this case? The null hypothesis says that the H0 says that mu1 is equal to mu2. That means there is no uh, mean difference between two paired groups. That means uh, mean marks in test 1 is not significantly different from mean marks in test 2. An alternative hypothesis says that we have the significant difference. Now let's understand how to perform a t-test in bad samples t-test in Excel. So you go to data tab. In data tab, you have the option of data analysis here. So click on data analysis. Once you click on data analysis, this dialog box will uh, open and here you have the option of t taste pad two samples, two sample for means. So simply click on OK. This dialog box will appear on your screen. Our variable one range is taste one. So you select taste one. Variable two range is taste two. So select taste two. Now, we need to select labels because name of the variables is written in the first row. Now, you go to output options and click on output range. Once you click on output range, you can generate the output on the same worksheet. So, simply click here on the box and select the cell. Click on OK. Now, you can see output is generated. So here we have the mean value, sample mean for taste 1 and taste 2. So the mean marks of taste 1 is 58 and mean marks of taste 2 is 61. Now what is T statistic here? For T stat, it is minus 3.4. And associated P value for two tail taste is here. That is 0 0.001. 981. Now, this p value, this p value is less than 0 0.05. Right? You can see this p value is less than 0 0.05. And therefore, we reject the null hypothesis. Since this is less than 0 0.05, to reject H0, and we can say that yes, we have the significant difference. So, mu1 is not equal to mu2. So, this is how we perform the pad samples t test in Excel. If you find this video useful, kindly like share, comment and subscribe. Thank you.